I am so happy right now. Look at all these people that came back. Let's see. One, two, three. Oh, there's four. Better than usual. I'm kidding. But the truth is, in an online class, it's, it's shocking to me always how little people actually watch these videos that I spend all my life putting together. But this is the way it is. Okay, so if you're not watching these videos, that's your prerogative. But understand that a huge part of your grade is the midterm and final and a half of those both those exams are based on supplemental lectures which you sh if you watch the tutorial you know how, what those are you're only going to get that one place that's in the lecture you're not going to find that on google or anything else so if you're not watching the videos you're not getting that information you're going to you're going to have a tough time with the uh, midterm and final okay uh Okay, so so we survive week one. So that's it's always a challenge because it's introductions, it's how to do this, how to do that, the syllabus, how I run a class, Silas Dean's dying strangely, all these things are happening. Okay, and it's hard sometimes to get across tutorials uh, online because it's easier, of course, when you're in a class face to face because it's easier to understand. So um, I apologize if any of it was was uh, complicated. I know some of you struggled with the with the definition assignments a little bit, not too bad. I think we have that. I think we have that straightened out. I've posted a few things on the announcements that hopefully clarified it. Very simple assignment. You've got two columns of concepts, uh, uh, key terms, and those are in the glossary. You find the definitions there. And the third column, key people, not in the glossary, but the page number next to it. Go to the page number in that chapter and and tell me what that what important you know uh, uh, event or incident or thing that person did. Okay, so that's it's that simple. Please, as we go to multiple chapters this coming week, we've got two chapters, and down the road we'll have three. Okay, this is a fast class. So when you do a, a, a definition assignments with multiple chapters, please keep it on one document. That's okay. You don't have to be all fancy about it at all. I just want your, you know, your name. Actually, I, I know who you are when you submit it because your name's there. Just make a list. Chapter eight, key key uh, key concepts, uh, terms. To this point, key people. To this point, and then go to chapter nine. So if it's three chapters, eight, nine, and ten, just do it all in one long document. So I can scan through it and see that you've done it. Okay. Um, okay. So um, m most of them look good. I haven't graded them all, but I have graded some, and, and most, you know, I, somehow we got it across. So that's good. Um, if you have an issue, there's a problem. Let me know. I know some of you are having textbook issues. You know, you, you really gotta get those textbooks quick in a, in a class like this because normally in a, in a regular class we would just be starting you know the chapters this next week we're already through you know on our way here okay so uh, okay so moving forward into uh, week two so again double chapters this week chapter two chapter three chapter two is called American experiments it talks about the colonial uh, you know, projects going on, different different European powers, you know, with, with colonies in the, in the New World and what would become the United States and how they, you know, stumble along and go through their conflicts and the British kind of gain, you know, prominence after almost failing. And so that's what that's about, American experiments. Chapter three is the British Atlantic world. What that means is as the colonies stabilize and start to prosper they start to make a lot of money so british becomes a world power and the, one of the wealthiest nations in the world at that time based on wealth coming from the new world or what would become the united states okay that as well as slave labor made them very very wealthy so chapter three is about the rise of that the british atlantic world the south atlantic system the triangular trade, the African slave trade, all kind of the same thing. It's about this triangular trade, okay? Uh, so that's what this what this week's about, okay? Also, when I when I post on on um, online, um, uh, I, I break it up into two classes, as you already know. Class one would be what I would typically teach in 
in a one one class in a, in an in class class and class two would be the other. So if it's a Monday Wednesday class, typically whatever I uh, would teach on a Monday class would be class one for you. What I would teach on a Wednesday class or Tuesday Thursday whatever would be class two. So I'm trying to break it up to make it more like a you know a regular class would be okay. But when you get to week two, you'll see that the first video is not about the chapters. It's a tutorial about our first film reflection paper, okay? This this will post on Friday next week, our, our week two, okay? Uh, the 12th, okay? So um, this is kind of advanced notice, but I always, you know, post the whole week. I don't want to wait to the third week to do it, so I'm doing it now. So you're gonna you're gonna get advanced notice. You can you can see this. It's it's up on on week two now. But understand it won't post officially till Friday. Okay, but you can get advanced notice and see what it's about. So the first one, of course, I spent a lot more time with because it's the first one that we've done. I'm telling you what I'm looking for, what the qualifications are. Okay, so please watch that tutorial about our first film, and that is entitled "The Color of Money, Colonialism, and the Slave Trade." And as you'll see there, in, in this case only, the first film, we actually have a, another document attached to the, to the instructions that I want you to read also. They, 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 they link together, okay? So please go through that tutorial, uh, you know, this week uh, to prepare yourself for the following week when you should be watching that film and, and writing your paper, okay? Okay, I think that's all we've got. Um, uh, good luck to you. If there's a, any problems, again, of course, email me. But, but first... Go to the discussion boards, and I, I had a little bit of problem with some access uh, this week, so that's been fixed. I hope um, I'll try to, you know, I can I can respond quicker than maybe I have in the past. Okay, um, okay, thank you very much.